Hey everybody, welcome back to Have the Popcorn. Thank you for clicking on this video. If you guys are new, my name is Stephanie. Today we're going to be talking about a primed new movie, Trip Zero. Your latest to glory. You just setting yourself up for your little heart to get broke. No, I set myself up to change my whole life. All right, so Trip Zero is rated PG. It is considered a drama comedy. That's an hour and 37 minutes long. It came out on Prime January the 17th. Trip Zero, you guys, surprisingly, is really good. It's a really nice, family-friendly movie. When I saw it, I was like, um, I don't know if I'm gonna like this or not. I honestly went in with very low expectations. The only reason I saw it was because I love Allison Janney and Viola Davis. I also saw that McKenna Grace was in the movie as well, and I'm a fan of hers from Fuller House. Um, now, I know that a lot of people may know her from a lot of these horror movies, but if you know me, you know I don't do horror, and if you're new here, welcome, how about subscribing to my channel. Just know I don't do horror movies. The whole family's gonna love it. It has such a great message. Uh, basically, just embrace your weirdness, um, which I love. For me, what separated this film from all the other movies that are, you know, about the same thing about being weird is that in this movie, they're not trying to hide it, they're not embarrassed by it, they're not trying to be something that they're not. Mikina plays Christmas, so off the bat, you're already going with this very unique name. And surprisingly, nobody actually makes fun of her um, for, for that name. Uh, the movies, uh, before I forget, the movie set like in the 70s or 80s? late 70s I think it was um, but either way it goes she loves science which in that time was like what no like that's not something that little girls you know should like you know, even her reason to want to join the birdies which is kind of like a girl scout deal is that you know she wanted to win this competition so she can record this basically um, time capsule deal that's going to be shot into space because they ended up finding a small group to be part of Troop Zero when they told her the only number that's left is zero and you know they kind of laughed like yeah like that this is like the zero troop you know like y'all are nothing and Christmas is all like <laughs> that's like an infinity number like laugh at this you're trying to be sarcastic but guess what this is infinity this is what this means so in your face so if you're you have a kid who is more on the otter side and maybe they're having problems you know trying to fit in with society or just whatever like watch this movie you guys because like seriously like they can take a lot from this you know movies do impact a lot of people in different ways again they never try to change for society they know that they're weird they're gonna continue to be weird um regardless of what the birdie standards are they're just like whatever um i guess the only kind of mini spoiler that i'll give is that they have true friendship because i don't know if i would actually be able to pee in front of a even if it's a small group of people for my friend i mean i i don't think i would I really don't like I, I love you guys but if you pee your pants I think you're gonna be alone on that one I would not join in um now I would join in if you pass gas like okay I'll fart but pee I feel like there's a different like level so you can take that friendship however you like um <laughs> but um, I know I necessarily didn't give you what the whole circumstance was don't want to ruin the movie for you guys but Overall, such a great film, very surprising. I really didn't go in there expecting much. It's a cute little film. It's not perfect, but the uh, the performances are amazing. Of course, it did have its predictable moment where they weren't friends, and then of course, they end up being the best of friends. Very predictable on, on that end, but it's definitely the one to watch. Give it a medium popcorn rating. If you've seen Troop Zero, what did you guys think about it? Did you like it? Did you love it? Did you hate it? Or was it just not for you? If you haven't seen it, are you looking forward to seeing it let me know down below but before you guys click on this video don't forget to give it a like subscribe to my channel if you haven't yet of course don't forget to hit the notification bell so you'll be notified each time i post something new and until next time i'll be seeing you guys at concessions bye